<laughs> Do you hear my boyfriend slithering on the floor? Are you wearing clothes? Hey guys, this is Dove Cameron. Um, I am at home, as you can tell, as we all are. Today, I am going to be trying and reviewing Youth to the People Spirulina Microalgae Kale Spinach Super Skin Reset Mask. Mm, cheesecake, star of the show. <laughs> this is not a good way to do this. Also, I don't know why I always skip this part. I have really naturally dry skin. Like when I was growing up, I remember having like, like really dry skin, aggressively dry skin, which is what got me involved in skincare really young. And so then I just got interested in skincare when I was like 10 years old. What kind of music do you like to listen to when you are masking and getting ready? I'm really on this big Upsol kick right now. I love Marina and the Diamonds. Lana Del Rey is my all time favorite though. Yeah, I don't know. I like a, I like a wide mix. Lightweight or heavy moisturizer? Heavy moisturizer. I feel like if I wear a lightweight moisturizer, I'm just putting it on nine times in a day, which there's nothing wrong with. But if I wear a heavy moisturizer, I put it on like three times. <laughs> Favorite beauty or wellness supplement? I feel like vitamin E. I've been taking a lot of vitamin E supplements lately and I'm a big believer <laughs> that if you take it internally, it's gonna show up externally. So I would say vitamin E, fish oil. Um, everybody always says it's really good for your skin. Turmeric is really good for clearing up inflammation. So yeah, those are my favorites. Tinted moisturizer or foundation? I'm gonna have to say foundation. I feel like I would I would rather go moisturizer, not tinted, or foundation. Um, I don't really like tinted moisturizer. I tried to get on board with it. I tried to love it. Um, and maybe I just haven't found the right one, but there's something about it. Like I feel like it doesn't ever match my skin tone. It either makes me look really pasty or it makes me look way darker than I am. Maybe it's just maybe something's weird with my skin tone, but I just don't like it. Send me your recommendations. Maybe I'll fall in love. I really want to. All time favorite serum, um, I would say is the Sturm Hyaluronic Serum. I just noticed such a big difference in it in my skin when I use it. But I also use this Mario Badescu Vitamin C Serum that is really great. Vitamin C is really great for brightening your skin. And I noticed that when I use that every other night, my skin is really bright and really responsive and really like supple when I wake up in the morning, so. All time favorite SPF and what number SPF? So these are the two SPFs I use. If I'm going out into the sun, like into the direct sun, I will use this Sturm Molecular Cosmetics Sun Drops SPF 50. And I will put this on after my oil, after my moisturizer, and I'll let that set for like 15 minutes just to get into my skin. And I'll put a few drops of this, not under my eye because it kind of stings my eyes sometimes, but I'll put it all over my face before my makeup. I don't notice any difference with this under my makeup. Um, it doesn't make it gross, it doesn't make it cakey. But also, big, big fan of this Kate Somerville Uncomplicated SPF 50 spray. If you've already done your makeup and you're like, Fuck, I need to put sunscreen on, I'm gonna burn. Put this stuff all over your face. It smells like lavender and it actually kind of doubles as a setting spray. It's really bizarre. Like it, it for some reason, it just like makes everything glowy and come together. This vitamin E oil. It is just straight up vitamin E oil. This is just what I got from Amazon. <laughs> I started doing it after I got off set sometimes. Like if my skin was really dry, I was just shooting a movie in New Mexico and it was like, it was like I was molting. And so I would take all my makeup off on set in the makeup trailer and then I'd put all this vitamin E oil on and just let it set in my skin while I was on my way home. After this, I kind of let it sit for five minutes and then I will either use Creme Riche Night Moisturizing Cream from Tata Harper. And then every once in a while, especially if I'm like traveling, um, at night I will switch to this Waleda Skin Food, which everybody swears by. It's got like, it has hardly any ingredients in it. Like it's just so simple. I'll put this on my face before I do my makeup, sometimes even during the day, and it will give me this like really intense glow under my makeup and it's really cheap. After that, right now I'm using this L'Occitane Immortel eye cream and I'll just dab it on, never drag. And then I will use this guy, which is like, it's this little under eye roller filled with rose quartz. I don't think the rose quartz really does anything, but uh, it's cute. And I bought it because it rolls really well and it can kind of like depuff your eyes as well. And then it works the serum in and sometimes it'll go up and around um, just because I feel like we kind of forget this area. If my skin is especially dry, as you guys are definitely realizing, I have very dry skin. Um, these are my two favorite masks. I'll sleep in these masks. That's a little crazy. Sometimes people can't sleep in face masks and I totally get that because I couldn't at first either. Um, but something about these fits my face really well and it just doesn't really bother me. I do wake up and they're halfway across the room though. So <laughs> maybe I don't sleep so well in them. This stuff is great. I think I got this at Anthropology on a whim um, and it's unbelievable. It's from Mantra Mask. This, which is my other all time favorite, this Lancome um, multi-action ultra lift. I would say that's like my number one beauty hack is to sleep in a face mask, sheet mask. 
if you can, obviously. If not, wander around the house for like eight hours in a sheet mask. What are my go-to health and wellness practices? Oil, water, sleep. Those are kind of my go-to, stay out of the sun. Craziest beauty treatment I've ever done. I feel like I've, I've gone to like Tracy Martin where they do like the electro current thing, where they like lift your face with like an electro current and you almost like taste metal in your mouth because there's electro currents going through your face. I feel like that's pretty crazy. Are you more of a skincare, makeup, or hair person? What is your thing? I would say I'm mostly a skincare person. I feel like my skin is something that I have known how to take care of since I was so young. But then quickly, quickly behind it, I'm a makeup person. I love makeup. I love doing my own makeup. I love experimenting. I would never go so far as to say I'm like good at doing my own makeup but I enjoy it. I love doing my makeup while I watch RuPaul's Drag Race because when the girls get ready and they do their makeup, I'm like, oh, it's like magic. I do deal with acne sometimes. I will admit not as much, uh, especially not as much as when I was younger, but I, we're wearing makeup all the time under hot lights, constantly having people reapply makeup all the time. So it's pretty impossible to avoid a breakout. I would say that my zit fighting routine, I don't know anything that fights acne and dry skin better than drinking like a ton of water. Went and I took off that mask and my skin feels unbelievable. So now that my mask is off, I'm gonna put this stuff on on camera so you can see. So I put on just about that much. I always put it on the back of my hand because I feel like it sinks in through the palm of your hand. This is the Barber Sturm Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I always feel like you should put everything on your skin in an upward motion. Okay, you guys, um, I just, my skin feels like really moisturized, really supple, feels like my pores shrank. It was really smooth, can you tell? Thank you so much for watching Masked and Answered. Now it's time for you guys to face mask and chill. Don't forget to subscribe to Marie Claire's YouTube channel and tell us which face mask you are loving in the comment section below. I love you guys, stay safe, stay home, and stay kind to yourselves.